everyone welcome back to hockey fever tv welcome back to a brand new video then today is the hockey india league is back from december onwards up to february this video we are going to see the journey from where it started the professional league where it started in india and how it evolved around and now it has come into the hockey india league the details what all happened we are going to see in the video come on let's go to the video journey from the premier hockey league to the world series hockey and to the hockey india league reflects the evolution of the professional or field hockey in india driven by the need to revitalize the sport and engage wider audience the launch the premier hockey league was launched in 2005 by the indian hockey federation in collaboration with espn it was india's first professional hockey league the first the phl featured a franchise based format with teams representing various cities the league was structured to create a competitive and entertaining atmosphere drawing inspiration from successful models in other sports format six teams were there in the uh, premier hockey league and the format of the game was uh, the first innovation there it was the 70 minutes uh, regulation time was split into four quarters one quarter 17.5 minutes so 17.5 into 4 is the 70 minute of the regulation time that there were timeouts for for each team one and one mandatory timeout was there that a timeout uh, model brought into the phl during the games was to improve the tv audience and bring in the advertisers for the sponsors for the league so after that this was the innovation another one was if the game ends in a draw the game was taken into extra time and for the first extra time was played with nine side both the sides nine side reduce two players if a winner is identified in the first uh, set of extra time they will take the extra bonus point if that first period of extra time of uh, ends in a draw and the game goes into the second period of extra time of 7.5 minutes with both the teams playing seven a side so if again a match is not found a winner then the match goes into the shootout shootout model of the uh, carrying the ball from the 25 to the goal to score a goal in 8 seconds was introduced first in world hockey in premier hockey league initially phl garnered significant attention with strong television view viewership and uh, fan support the league provided a platform for the domestic players to show uh, showcase their talents and gain exposure and initially the, there were two tiers in the uh, premier hockey league which was interesting tier 1 and tier 2 the last place team in the tier 1 goes to uh, gets relegated to tier 2 and the winner of the tier 1 tier 2 gets promoted to the Uh, main tier one competition and th this uh, promotion and relegation format was lasted just one season and after that it was just six six teams affair challenges for the uh, premier hockey league despite the early success the phl uh, faced several challenges including financial instability lack of uh, consistent sponsorship and other administrative issues these factors led to its eventual decline with the league uh, folding up winding up in 2008 in 2012 the world series hockey there was launched the world series uh, hockey was an ambitious uh, uh, project also like the phl initiated by Indian Hockey Federation with collaboration with Nimbus Sport. Uh, the World Series Hockey. It was a direct response to increasing popular popularity of the game again, and the uh, we, uh, World Series Hockey aimed to professionalize hockey in India by offering players lucrative contracts and uh, bringing in international stars. But the controversies and conflict happened again. The World Series Hockey (WSH) was marked by controversy due to conflict between IHF and Hockey India, which was the newly uh, recognized governing body for hockey in India by the FIH. So many top Indian players and foreign players were caught in a dilemma 
between playing for the national team and participating in the World Series Hockey as Hockey India did not recognize the World Series Hockey. So after that the impact and decline of the World Series respect attracting some attention featuring high quality hockey. The World Series Hockey struggled in sustainability. It faced issues uh, related to player availability, legal battles and lack of recognition. The league did not continue beyond its year, uh, inaugural season. From the year 2013, the Hockey India League was started and in 2012, the World Series Hockey was discontinued. Immediately after that, Hockey India League was launched in 2013 with the objective of creating world-class professional league that could attract top talent from around the globe and boost the popularity of hockey in India. So the HL adopted a franchise-based model similar to the Premier Hockey League and the World Series Hockey. The league featured teams representing very various cities and with players from both India and overseas. The league had a strong focus on providing high quality competition and entertain entertainment. From the year 2016, two goals were awarded for a field goal and that was an innovation which attracted so in the situation when the team is two, go two goals down, if they score a field goal, they come into two goals apiece and they draw level and if they are even one goal down and they score a field goal they win the match 3-2 in, in that combination so that was a good in, in initiative from the Hockey India League so hope those uh, you know, innovations can be taken by the international hockey. Global appeal of HL was successfully att attracted to players, coaches, international players, coaches and sponsors elevating the standard of the competition. The league became a key platform for the domestic players to compete against the best in the world and improve their skills. So unlike in the previous uh, PHL and WHH where the players were drafted into various teams, the HL uh, brought the auction, player auction into effect and which was more effective bringing uh, the competitiveness more and the players getting more lucrative salary. And, uh, and despite its success, HL was put on hold after 2017 season due to scheduling conflicts with the international hockey calendar and challenges in securing long-term sponsorship and the owners of the franchises incurring losses due to the scheduling of the home and away basis. So even after that, the in between uh, the uh, Hockey India were trying to revive the Hockey India League but nothing happened and now it is going to happen before we go into those details we have to see the legacy conclusion part is the journey from the premier hockey league to world series hockey and finally to the hockey india league reflects the efforts of uh, to revive the pro professionalized hockey in india each league despite its challenges and eventual discontinuation contributed to the sports growth and left a uh, lasting impact on indian hockey the lessons learned from these leagues continue to influence in the development of hockey in the country. From PHL to WSH to HIL and back to Hockey India League which is revived and HIL 2024. So will this league go in the long run, become a successful hockey league and will these uh, problems which uh, crept in in the previous leagues occur in this league also or will this league go in a successful manner in the upcoming years and go in the long run uh, put in your thoughts on the comment box how this league will be featuring how it will go in a profitable way for the franchise owners and all other things you put on the comment box and that will be much appreciated and will be much encouraging for us and engaging for us so again from our channel we hope that the hockey india league from 2024 becomes a grand success and runs in the long run and becomes one of the best hockey leagues in the world of hockey.